How to create a toggle list in Notion 2025. In this video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be talking in great detail on how you're going to be going ahead and creating a toggle list for yourself in Notion in the easiest way. So to start things off, first of all, do make sure to check the link down in the description below to get discounted pricings and plans off of Notion. Now, once you've done that and you've come right into your Notion, what we're going to be doing is, first of all, to create toggle lists. We're going to create a new page for ourselves, okay? And we're simply going to call this page Lists. Now, once you've done that, right about here is where the magic starts, okay? So what we're going to be doing is we're going to click Slash, and we're going to write To-Do List. And once you click on To-Do List, as you can see here, you have To-Do List opened up. Now, if you tick, the to-do happens, but if you don't tick, obviously it stays unchecked. And what you can do is you can interact with these to-do lists in different ways as well. But obviously, to get the proper toggle, you're going to search up toggle lists. Let's say I'm going to write in, let's say Monday, and we're going to write in Tuesday. Okay, we're going to add these two over here. And once you've done that, you can open it up, toggle it in, and right about here, let's say you can add calendars, you can add calendar views if you want to, et cetera. If I close down this toggle list, it closes down. So just like that, you can create toggle lists for yourself in Notion in the easiest and most simplest way. So thank you for watching this video all the way till the end, and I'll be seeing all of you in the next video. Have a great day. Goodbye.